Okay, we're just a little ways in off of Schoolhouse Road. And we came down from there. And this is where Panther Run splits off. We're going that way. Panther Run goes straight down that hill. Should have called it Goat Run. Steep as that is. And it's July 3rd. A crispy start at about 46 degrees, but it's really pretty comfortable when you're moving. About a mile in on Mid-State Trail coming down from Schoolhouse Road. And we went up for a little bit. And now we're pretty much running along this ridge line. And dropping off a little bit. Not too much. Uh, but it's a perfect day out. Uh, we're sort of joined together with this other yellow blaze trail up here. I'm up on the rock. Ugh, a little dog down below. Okay, that's good. Take a picture. Now, let me see. Get my profile where I look skinnier. He's trying to get Okay, up. we're starting down this ridge line right there. You can see mountains to the left of us and mountains to the right. And the little dog is off and running. The intersection of Panther Run and Love Run. And we follow Love Run, the Mid State Trail does, that direction. Well, you can see. We're still coming down steep all the way down. And we haven't even gotten to the two mile mark yet. I would guess it's coming up here pretty soon. But this goes all the way down to the bottom of Love Run and then we'll head up. We're at two miles and we're still going downhill, walking down Love's Run, which you can see below. And every step down means a step back up the big hill. We just crossed Love's Run by this little camp. And you get to head up this mountain. So it's all uphill for the next mile. Oh. Okay, this is very steep. We just came up from down below. And we've been working about a mile going up this hill. And as you can tell, it's not getting any better. I'm hoping that's the top. See how steep it is with Leanne coming up. Hard, hard climb. We're doing the ridge walk between the two mountains. One we just came up and the next one we're going to be going down so resting up because it's going to be a sharp drop a thousand feet over less than a mile. Fun. The ridge right above Pine, Little Pine State Park and there's all these huge rocks here. You can see them stretched everywhere and a little tree growing right up in between. Pretty incredible. The trail goes right between those two rocks and over. At the top of the ridge uh, before going down to Little Pine State Park and you can see it drops off on that side and then you have the trail and it drops off on that side. We're pretty much walking right along the ridge line. We're coming down this last edge and you can see there's a couple of these great big spots where it's open and it's a huge rock formation. We're just going to keep following it down. Oh. 